Hello everyone and welcome back to Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator 2. Today we've got a very special video for you. It's a 100 subscriber special, so I just wanted to say a quick thank you to all the support you guys have been giving me recently. It's been absolutely fantastic. I know it's really cliche to say, but I genuinely mean it. So getting straight into this video today, what are we doing for the 100 subscriber special? Well, these are no regular archers. These are custom archers that I have made myself. And what's special about these? Well, these guys will pump out 20 million arrows a second yeah that's right 20 million arrows a second so what we're going to put it against well of course we're going to put it against 12 million zombies coming from all sides now i am for this gonna to have to do something just to show you how crazy this is i'm gonna to have to put it in slow motion from the start so well <laughs> guys you're not gonna believe this honest to god it's I've got a 3090 and a 3070 hooked up to this computer, like the graphics cards, and it struggles. <laughs> it struggles, so... Yeah, let's, uh... Let, yeah, 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 you'll just see. Let's get into this. <laughs> there we go! That is not my screen breaking. That is... <laughs> 20 million arrows! <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, that is my computer actually breaking because there's that many arrows i'm gonna have to zoom out so, so some of them despawn but they are actually there <laughs> i know it just looks like black fuzz but trust me they are so many arrows right now and what happens is because how i've set these units up is basically they have one percent accuracy so what they're actually doing is firing in a dome around them. It, it, <laughs> no matter where you stand. Look, there's arrows coming over here. But yeah, the poor guys are getting the the brunt of it over there. Let's go have a look at the actual carnage on the ground, eh? Here comes a wave now. And bear in mind, this is in slow motion because there's just so many arrows to calculate. You know, it's like that scene from 300 where they said our arrows will block out the sun. Well, this is how you actually block out the sun with arrows. However, I will say when I do speed it up, they don't fire as many arrows. It just seems to be like when it's in slow motion. <laughs> like they're not even aiming over here in these arrows just raining down on these poor zombies. It's the only time I've ever felt so for an evil team. Just absolute devastation. There's no way anything lives through that. <laughs> God. They only have a certain range as well, so it'll be like the zombies will never be able to get past a certain point. Like, can you even tell there's another half of the map here? I know my computer's struggling. I'm so sorry, but. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything quite that insane? And, oh god, yeah, don't get close. So, what we're going to do now, is we're going to take off slow motion. They aren't going to fire as many arrows, because they're just not, the computer's just not able to process how many are being fired. However, I think you get the general idea. Don't get me wrong, they are still going to fire a lot of arrows. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of, like, sound waves just... Yeah. Oh god, this is... I'm so sorry, guys. The frame rate is absolutely tanking, but I'm sure you can understand why. So if we go a bit further out... There we go. Nice and smooth here. Oh my god. Look how many troops are dying every second. Just absolute thousands of them. Oh, there's another volley coming out over here. Oh my god. <laughs> it is quite literally raining arrows. I'd be quite amazed if the zombies actually manage to get quite close to them here. Maybe the terrain actually might help them out. Because it does sort of look like 
they sort of struggle to see them over here. Oh, look out. Incoming. They're just getting absolutely massacred. Let's go have a look over here. See what's happening on this flank. Oh, God. That is absolutely insane. Like, when you do get close to it, it really does just block out the sun. Oh, God. Can you imagine how many arrows have actually been fired by this point? I really wasn't lying when it was, I said it was 20 million arrows a second. In fact, it could even be more. Here we go, the bodies are actually starting to pile up now. So what it actually does is it creates a weird dome effect. Let's go have up, see if I can show you. Oh, that is free. <laughs> it's dang in the frame rate. I've never had my 3090 and the 3070 struggling. But yeah, as you can see, it sort of creates this weird dome effect. Though I will say it's not as effective on this side. It, the terrain is really helping the zombies get closer here. Whether you want to get closer to that is an entirely different question. Oh my. So many bodies. <laughs> I like how these like weird little gaps in between the waves so you can tell how quick their attack speed is. Perhaps this is what they needed in Game of Thrones. Then they wouldn't have needed a 15 year old to assassinate, you know, the king of the undead. But, you know. I guess they didn't have auto archers back there. Oh my god. I don't care how many times you see it. Imagine running up the hill. And just seeing that. You wouldn't, would you? You'd t even if you were a mindless, undead zombie. <laughs> you'd see that and go, Nope, that ain't for me. God, it's this part here in particular. Like this. Oh my god. Okay, let's slow down a bit. Let's slow it down a bit. Let's try and get some frames back. Oh my god. I am getting... 8 frames a second when I look at it. But as you can see, it doesn't matter where you are, the landing over here, all the way to over there. I think this is the actual full-on range of it, roughly. Oh my. Just look at that. absolute complete insanity like I don't think even a shield would help at this point I think so many arrows would get stuck in your shield that you just wouldn't be able to lift it above your head oh my God. it just looks like my monitor's broken on one side like it's just a load of static but no they're actually arrows and these poor zombies are just running into it constantly. Now look, no matter which angle I'm coming from here, there's just arrows flying everywhere. Though we'll say the side is again having the most success. And when I say most success, I... Oh, jeez, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry guys, this is going to absolutely tank the frame rate, but we're going to have to try to get close to that. I'm going in. Wish me luck. Wish my graphics card luck. Oh, my poor computer. It's just vomiting arrows. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't look. I can't actually look. I'm getting 9 frames a second. God knows what this is going to look like on YouTube. I am so sorry, folks. Okay, let's speed this back up now. Let's see what it's like. <laughs> they are literally just vomiting arrows everywhere. Oh 
the zombies are just getting absolutely mowed down. Like, can you imagine how many arrows ends up in each individual zombie? Oh, here's a wave. There goes a wave. Absolutely mowed down. I guess some of the arrows are, like, really hitting quite far back over here. Oh, and we think we've got some of our first pools of blood actually showing up. Look at that. I think this is good enough for a 100 subscriber special, don't you? I think the archers agree. It seems like they're having a whale of a time here. It'd be interesting to actually see if the zombies ever get close to this. Because I've got to think, the more the bodies pile up, the more protection they've got, right? So the closer they get. It could actually come to a point where they start drowning the archers. Now that would be kind of interesting. But I suppose they've got to get close enough to do that. And I just, yeah, I can't see that actually happening now. Now that I think about it. So many zombies are dying each second. Let's have a look at that. Yeah, so my, my reckoning, about 3,000 zombies are dying a second. That's, that's some insane numbers. It's a small village wiped out every second. Oh, here comes an income. A massive volley. I don't know what he is. Oh my god. Well, I don't think there's any words that can describe what just happened to them poor zombies. <laughs> it's the only time I've actually fe feeling sorry. I was feeling? Felt sorry for zombies. I'm feeling sorry. You poor, mindless drones. Oh, they're actually getting down here, though. Look at that. No, no. No, they're not. Who am I kidding? They've only managed to kill two million of them so far, so... You know, the zombies are going quite strong. They've still got another ten million that they can fling at these archers. You know what? When the video's over, I might actually try to do the math on how many arrows could have possibly been fired. <laughs> no, I don't think I want to. I don't think the screen will be big enough to fit the number on. Oh! It's like the range has suddenly stopped. Oh, no, no. It's back. Go on, guys. You're going to have to run faster than that. Oh, look at this guy. He's going. He's making it. You go, son. Oh. Oh, there's a few more. Let's go. Where'd they go? Guys? Guys? Guys, yeah, like high school all over again. Anyway, back over here. Let's see what we got going on. Just a lot of dead. Like, the bodies are getting so hot, hit so hard, they just do not know which way to face. Gee. There's so many arrows coming out. There's so many. I mean, you can really see here the ring that they actually land in. Let's go over here and have a look at this. We have actually got quite a lot of blood showing up now. There's a chance that uh, the zombies are going to start funneling themselves, which is... Uh, oh, they do not want to do that. It's already going to be hard enough for them to get close. But I genuinely think that the best attempt so far we've had it is on these sides here. Because the arrows can't really hit them. And I've got to think that the more these bodies build up, look, like, these guys are completely safe at the moment. Like, no arrows are hitting here. So I've sort of, well, I say no arrows. They are actually, behind this mound in particular, 
But yeah, I guess they are sort of hitting <laughs> back here. My god. Just absolute insanity. I know I keep saying it, but there's just so many arrows. What are they going to do? What are the zombies ever going to do to get close to this? Like, unless they literally develop super mutants or drown the archers. And I don't think there's going to be enough of them to drown the archers. Like, I'm considering the archers are also on top of a hill, it's going to be almost impossible. This at this moment is just us watching 12 million zombies get absolutely massacred. In celebration of 100 subs, so... Hey subs, you guys brought this on. I think you owe an apology to the zombies. Well, with the zombies ever pushing forward, their only hope really is that enough of them that die that they can form walls to actually protect themselves from the arrows, but that seems highly unlikely. Well, perhaps the part where they actually form a wall of bodies. Maybe that's the most likely part, but protection? Ah, maybe not. I don't think there's anything that's going to protect these zombies here. The lakes of blood now are really starting to get big. This desert is going to be nourished after we're done. There's going to be beautiful palm tree, and it's all thanks to rotten zombie blood. And who knows in the future, if there's ever an archaeological dig, maybe they'll wonder why there's 400 billion arrows in the ground. You know who I feel sorry for in all of this? The Fletchers. Them poor guys have been making these arrows day in, day out. And just look what it's happened. Look what it's come to. Now, I'm pretty sure they wouldn't complain with stopping a zombie apocalypse. That, that, that's probably... They probably can get behind that. <laughs> they probably can get behind that. Speaking of getting that behind that, you guys, you here are probably some of the only hope of ever getting close to it. You need to build a wall. Like Trump, you need to build a wall of uh, of corpses. Not saying that Trump built his wall out of corpses, but... It's a metaphor, I guess. Right, I don't think there's a single zombie that hasn't got a blood splat on him at this point. Oh, I really... I wouldn't fancy my chances. Even with a shield, I don't care. I don't think there's anything that can stop that many arrows. The bodies here are really starting to pile up now. We're back down to uh, six and a half million zombies left. Just wave after wave, absolutely cut down. Right, is there anyone, have they actually got, I've got to get close here guys, I'm sorry. But I need to see how close zombies have actually got. So, the frame rate is going to tank. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry at the same time, because it looks glorious. So, let's get in. If, if we get so close that we can't see the arrows. There we go. Can we see anything at all? <laughs> so it doesn't look like any zombies have actually... Like, if you actually look at them, they all look like they're shooting in slow motion. Oh, no, no, there we go. He's, uh... Yeah, he caught up then. Jeez, I've got so many arrows. Like, you can see, just, like, they fire him every direction instantly. Oh god, you do not want to come over that hill, guys. No, guys. <laughs> so in this game, there is god powers. Like the shotgun, there's Noah's Flood. There's even a new... Ah, uh, I think we should have this as a god power. Being able to fire 20 million arrows every second. Jeez. And like I said, I, I literally have... A 3090 and a 3070 hooked up to this computer. 
<laughs> it's maxing them both out. Oh my god. Hello? Yeah, no, oh, we're back. Like, you got to think, the fewer and fewer zombies that they are as well, just that the chance of any of the archers actually dying, just, it dwindles away faster and faster. Like, I'm amazed. Look, like, the zombies actually managed to get this far. And then arrows just come in. And they just disappear. My god. This is must have... This... Uh, I had to stroke that, sorry. This is what it must have been like in Agincourt. Like when the British Longmow men just cut down hundreds of troops where they stood. Like I said, this part here in particular, these where they're forming proper little mounds like this, they're actually managing to get a little bit close. It sort of reminds me of the, I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, the Iron Dome in Israel, which is like a, an anti-missile defense system that fires missiles at incoming missiles. It's quite a thing to see, it's quite a spectacle. But it just sort of reminds me of that, like, they are the archer equivalent of the <laughs> Israeli Iron Dome. It's just insane. Like, you do not want pathing issues here. I keep seeing, like, every now and then you'll get a zombie who, like, runs into another one and they just stop. <laughs> you, not, you're as good as dead. These lakes are now starting to slowly form oceans. The zombies are actually struggling to get through them. Are any of them actually drowning? Oh, yeah, look. Oh, a few of them have actually drowned. So that's why they're actually managing to get across this part, is because a few of them drown, so they're just running across the corpses of the dead. Which is exactly good practice for what they'll be doing when they get close. Oh my god. So many bodies. Well, it kind of makes you wonder how there's that many bodies here, because it doesn't look like there's any zombies that get that close. Oh no, here they come. They are literally like in waves. There they go. Oh my god. Oh look, here we go. They're getting close. Let's go with them. Just about a hundred zombies cut down in a second. Like I said, typically, the more that die, in theory, the more defense the zombies actually have, but how do you defend against that? Like, that's insane. It doesn't seem to matter how many zombies get over this part here, they just die. Let's follow them in. Predicting any second now they're just going to get wiped off the face of the earth. Here it comes, can you feel it? Here it comes. Oh god. My poor computer. God knows what this looks like on YouTube. The rendering. <laughs> the rendering on this. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I've just realised this is probably just going to look like a pixel nightmare. I might have to upscale this to 4K just to force YouTube to use the better rendering. Because there's no way YouTube render is going to be able to handle that many arrows. My PC can barely handle that many arrows. The wall over here of zombies is really starting to get high, but it really just isn't helping. Oh, you see him in the background as well, making hills. It's like party streamers coming in. 
absolutely cut down. It's kind of weird, at certain angles you can actually see through the, the mounds of bodies, like here, look. You can sort of see through the, the bodies until you get close. A little bit weird, but oh well. Oh, I'm like there. I can see the floor. Perhaps more zombies need die. We're down now to 4.3 million zombies. And the body piles are just getting insane here. wonder how many litres of blood have actually been spilt. Oh, hang on. Incoming static. <laughs> there has to be have been billions of arrows fired by this point. Like, an insane amount of arrows have to have been fired. And yet, they still just keep coming. Relentless. Their first for human flesh is driving them crazy. They want to get there, and they'll just die in their millions to do it. It's kind of ironic, really, if you think about it. All these zombies, they want the taste of flesh and blood, and there's just like, you know, they're running through, through blood just to get the taste of it. Yeah, I know. Before the comments say, yeah, I know, it's not, it's not blood that zombies want. It's brains and human flesh, I know. But they're not getting anything here other than arrows. Yeah. That is just... It's kind of stupid. It's like a magic trick. Now you see zombies, now you see arrows, and now you see no zombies. Let's get a better look at this. It's kind of hard to see the zombies, because... <laughs> it's just... Oh, but you can see the arrows. The arrows you can see, no problem. Let's, uh, let's go possess one of these zombies and see what it's like. So this is me. I'm in first person now. We're running up to the zombie pile. Let's go. The fallow zombies. Oh god. Oh god, please not me. Oh, it's getting so laggy. I'm making it. Oh. I, I died. Well, it's okay because a leg has grown inside of me. That was, uh, it was kind of scary actually. It's not something you really want to do. Let's do it again. Let's go up. Oh, here they come. Oh, it's so laggy. I can't look at it. I'm so sorry, guys. There's just too many arrows. <laughs> I made it. I made it. Let's go. Oh. I died. So I made it to the bottom and then died. A bit like these guys here. Oh, no, they're getting a lot closer than I do. I paved the way for them. Go. You can do it, guys. We have faith. We have faith. Well. <laughs> okay, okay. The dead. Well, you guys are going to make a beautiful compost heap. That's all I can say. There'll be a brilliant oasis here one day. Thanks to you. And possibly... A mine. This isn't like an iron mine because the amount of arrowheads that are going to be in the floor. Yeah, you could have a profitable business for years to come digging up them arrowheads. So we're now down to 3.2 million zombies. I don't think there's any second guess in it now they are pretty much never going to get to these archers maybe 
Maybe I shouldn't have used a, used a thousand of them. Maybe a thousand was a bit too much. Maybe a hundred? But, I don't know. I kind of liked the sound of 20 million arrows a second. So, we ended up with a thousand. Oh look, these are actually somewhat clean zombies. I mean, they were. Just absolute carnage, constant arrows. And then it's like weird. It's like a trickle of arrows. Like a normal, that's what you'd expect normally. You know, a couple of hundred thousand. And then it just pours. <laughs> and the zombies die in their thousand. Like, I think, actually, realistically, it'd be impossible to walk. Because all these corpses here would be absorbing the arrows that were coming in. So the floor would literally be nothing but arrows. You'd have to walk over arrows just to get anywhere. It'd be the world's biggest pincushion. Right, here we go. And absolute massacre. But look, again, these mounds here, this is where the safe spots are. These zombies here, not getting hit by any arrows. So if you get to this part, at least you have a chance, maybe. But then you've just got to make it over this hill here. But we can see, bit by bit, they are actually clawing their way there. Maybe if there was like, I don't know, 400 million of them, they'd get close, but... I don't know. 12 million, they're struggling. They're really struggling at 12. That is, I think that's the closest they've got. So, congratulations to you, sir, madam, thing. Oh, no, no, we have a new contender. At 4 FPS, we had a new contender. I think that's the only reason he actually managed to get there, was because the FPS was tanking. So, yeah, he he's probably going to be our winner, I think. Let's go see. Anyone else closer? No, none of the, I can't look at the arrows, otherwise I won't be able to do, do this. Oh god, there's just so many of them. There's so many. It's absolute insanity. I can feel the heat radiating, radiating off my graphics card at the moment. As it just goes, what the hell are you trying to make me render? Meanwhile, in the background, literal oceans of blood now. I think we are getting to the point where we... Is this bigger than a lake? Can we classify this as an ocean now? I mean, I guess it's a lake, really, because they're still able to traverse through it. But, I don't know. He could get a decent little sailboat on it. I'll call it a lake. Okay, so what I want to do now is I want to categorise the types of <laughs> blood that we have here. This, this I'm going to call a lake. This is definitely a lake. It's, it's big enough to be a lake. You can get a boat in there. It's deep enough for it. This over here, this is like, sort of like, a posh lake in a back garden of a mansion. It's not quite a lake, but it's too big to be a pond. You know what I mean? Now this over here, this here, this. This is your classic pond of blood. Absolutely, categorically, a pond of blood. Perfect depth for ducks. You won't really be able to get a boat on it, and it's deep enough in the middle that people can't go through it. Definitely a pond. Now, what we have over here, this is a lagoon. I like to call this a lagoon of blood. Why? Because it just shaped like one. Don't question my reasoning. So what we actually have over here, this here is almost, almost an island of blood. If we, There we go. Officially, for a second, there we go. It's officially now an island of blood. So there we go, we've got Blood Island, we've got ponds, we've got lagoons, we've got lakes. We've got all your different kinds of blood here. And that's the kind of content you won't get on any other channel. 
Anyway, getting back to the absolute chaos of it all. The zombies are still trying to push forward. Ever forward, my faithful friends. But unfortunately, as we can see, 20 million arrows a second is proving to be way too much for them. And frankly, I might do this test again with shields just to see if the shields can actually get close. Because I don't think the results will be too much different. Because some of the shields do have a chance to deflect arrows. Oh my god, look at the bug. Sorry, I distracted myself there. But yeah, shields do have a chance to deflect arrows, but I just think there's too many of them here. Though, so it might be an interesting experiment. Let me know what you think below in the comments. See, well, look at this. Look <laughs> at this. Absolute mound of bodies. Like, look, this was a hill downwards. Like, a smooth hill down. And now it's just cratered with bodies. I do like the uh, the double humps that we've made here. I'm quite surprised that blood hasn't actually started pooling up in between these yet. I think the bodies are actually covering up most of the blood. Oh, you poor guys. You poor souls. You have no idea what you're running into. Well, maybe you have a little bit of an idea of what you're running into. So we're now down to the last one million zombies. And <laughs> frankly, the less they are, the less chance they have. I mean, just running up this hill, you just don't want to see that. Look at that. Oh my god. Just cut down hundreds of them. These guys are actually making a decent attempt though. They're sort of almost getting there. Uh, oh, no, it's hit the side. It hit the side. A lot of them live. I mean, not on that side, but in the middle over here, they live. What happens then? Oh, this is where... Yeah. In comes 20 million arrows. Oh, no, not at these, though. They're actually surviving a bit. They're actually getting close. Look at this guy here. Look at him go. Oh, never mind. He died. You did well, though. He got quite close. Oh, there. Yep. There comes the death. <laughs> there comes death and four FPS. Let me out of these arrows. Oh, God. There's so many. Oh, my. We're actually starting to run out of zombies now. 600,000 zombies left. I think most of them are actually stuck here. They've just got no chance of getting there. The last 500,000 zombies now. Slowly running towards their death. So many times. <laughs> oh my god. Just so many of them all die at once then. 400,000 now. That was quick. They're really dying off quick now that there's none of them left. There's just the few stragglers. But what difference are they really going to make? They're just going to make these mountains slightly... <laughs> yeah. God. Look out, guys. Incoming. I don't know why I'm saying look out. They are just getting absolutely wrecked. Approaching our last 300,000. God, what's that like? 50,000 a minute? A dying? Something crazy like that. God, the body mounts are just so high. So much blood has to have been spilt here. I mean, we can see it pooling up down there, but... It's just insane. <laughs> I 
<laughs> would you want to ever see that in real life? I don't think I would. I'd be scared to see that, even if it was just like a demonstration. It's like when you see a nuke go off for the first time. It's like, it's, it's very pretty and all, but I don't want to be there. Just so many bodies piled up here. Literally 12 million bodies piled up. There was no mountains here. <laughs> Bear that in mind. This was all flatland. Well, I say flat, but it was smooth, at least. It was all smooth here. And now it's just mounds of dead, rotting flesh. Probably covered in arrows as well. <laughs> you can actually see the waves of zombies here. No pun intended. But the waves of the dead bodies. <laughs> she got hit straight in the head then. I don't know if you guys saw that. Okay, down to the last 70,000. Well, 78,000. That's pretty much you guys. You are the last hopes for the zombie race. And I've got to say, it's not looking good for you. It's not looking good for you guys at all. When you get to that top of that hill, there's just death up there for you. To be honest, there's death anywhere here. <laughs> I don't think it matters where you stand. There's just so many arrows. How are you going to dodge 20 million arrows coming at you? You literally can't. As these guys are brutally finding out. The next wave running up the hill. So, are these the only guys left now? I believe these are the only guys left. Let's go have a look. Just bodies, corpses over here. There is absolutely... No living left. The last 24,000 are over here. Well, I say there's no living. There's no one dead left. The last 24,000 zombies are all here. You are the last hopes of the evil empire. The last 16,000. Like, every single wave is just absolutely insane. So we're at 16,000 we were. And after that wave of arrows, we're down to about 10,000. So 6,000 died in a wave. I'm only going to die in this one. So from 10,000, what are we going down to? And not as bad, not as bad. Only 2,500 odd. And is this going to be the last valley? Will that finish them? No, no, only about 3,000, 4,000 in that one. I say only about 4,000. 4,000 dead in one volley of arrows. Most of them don't even see where the arrows are coming from. Oh, God. 12 left. Where are they? Poor? Oh, here they are. The poor, unfortunate few. These 12 zombies. Let's put it in slow motion. Let's have a look at these guys. Oh, I was too slow. Unfortunately, I was too slow. Yeah, Archer Full Auto 1. Is anyone surprised? Really? Is anyone truly, honestly surprised? But anyway, guys, that is all we have time for today. Once again, I just want to say thank you very much for 100 subscribers. It's absolutely insane to me. Um, I hope to see many more of you for years to come. Uh, but yeah, that is all we have time for today, I'm afraid. So I'll see you in the next video. Oh, one last thing. Comment, like, subscribe. Or I'll sell your grandmother. No, I won't. I'm only joking. Bye.